the town of Sadranga Patina predates the arrival of the Dutch by at least four centuries. 13th century inscriptions call it Rajanarayana Patina. From a time when the Samburaya chieftains, vassals of the Cholas, ruled vast tracts of land here. When the Dutch arrived on the Coromandel coast in 1606, they first pitched base at Polite, which is north of Chennai. By 1612, they had laid the foundations for a fort in Sadras to its south. It is a well-known place for giving muslin clothes and brick making. The Dutch fortified its early outposts in Silo, Batavia and other places with bricks made in terms in this place. For the next 200 years, the British, Dutch and the French fought for the mastery of the Coromandel coast. The control of Coromandel coast meant control over the blue ocean that rolled away from these shores to other colonies in Asia like Indonesia, Malaysia, Singapore, etc. The Battle of Sadras was the first in a series of indecisive battles fought between the British and the French for the colonial power. By 1854, Sadras fought had passed into the hands of the British. The British must have laid siege to this fort sim to the similar way they did in Alamparai fort and bombarded it with cannons from their huge ships, probably men of war. But it is not so damaged like the Alamparai fort. Uh, which also had a port in it. In this case, uh, the Sadras, it, it is a fort mostly. We will continue going through the Sadras fort in the next episode as well. Enjoy the view. Oh, 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 oh,